uh, this is a story that uh, very much deserves our continued focus. And Congressman, I know you were just down on the yes. border. Uh, what did you see there? Uh, what is underway? What is not underway? And did they let you see the things you came to look for? Not all of the things that we came to look for. I visited uh, three uh, centers with uh, Senator Gillibrand out of New York. Uh, we started off in McAllen and then ventured uh, to uh, Brownsville and then went to Carnes County, which is a detention center that's just outside of San Antonio. Uh, and there were a lot, lots of problems. You can tell that the Trump administration was just woefully unprepared uh, to deal with uh, separating so many children from their families. And I, th I thought the most troubling thing uh, that we saw, uh, particularly at the detention center in McAllen, was that you had uh, a young girl that was two years old, that mm -hmm. they wouldn't let her near her father. And it was just absolutely uh, awful. Uh, at one of the, at one of the uh, HHS facilities that we visited in Brownsville, you have uh, eight boys for every caseworker there. And so when we were there, there were 1,400 boys that were there. This is a center for 10 to 17-year-old boys. And they're trying to reunite them, but they're only reuniting 150 to 125 to 150 a week. And, 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 and you just, when you leave, you tell yourself there's no way they're ever going to be able to reunify all of these children with their families. And that's